Welcome to the MosiPro Tutorials. Now that you have installed the MosiPro client on your PC, the next thing you need to do is select files for backup. The MosiPro client provides two methods for selecting files for backup, that is, backup sets and file system. This tutorial focuses on backup sets. In particular, we will explain what backup sets are, demonstrate how to select files for backup using backup sets, and explain how to create custom backup sets. Backup sets are accessed through the Settings window in the Mosey Pro Client. Right-click on the icon located in the taskbar, select Settings, then select More Settings. If prompted, enter your user password and click Login. Now to configure your backup sets, click on the Backup Sets tab at the top of the Settings window. A list of backup sets is displayed in the left pane and if you click on a backup set, a list of all files matching that backup set rule are displayed in the right pane. So what are backup sets? Backup sets let you select files for backup according to their file type, size, last modified, created and file or folder name. You can then specify the folders that you want to search for the files in. For example, if you select the word Processing Documents Backup Set, the Mosey client will search the Desktop and the My Documents folders on the C drive for Microsoft Word, OpenOffice.org, WordPerfect, Adobe Acrobat and text file types and will select them for backup. Also, all subsequent files saved to your computer in these folders that have the same file extensions are automatically added to your backups. By default, if a backup set does not have files that meet the backup set rules, that backup set will not be listed as available in the backup sets window. However, the full backup set can be displayed by clicking on Options and Advanced and checking Show all pre-configured backup sets. If we now click on the backup sets tab again, the full backup set list is displayed. If you want to include a backup set as part of your files for backup, simply check the box next to the backup set. For example, if you want to backup all your spreadsheet and database file types that are located in My Documents and on the desktop, simply check the box next to the backup set, Spreadsheets and Databases. A full list of all files matching the backup set criteria are displayed in the right pane and all the checkboxes next to the files are checked. Now if you decide you don't want to back up these files anymore, simply uncheck the box next to Spreadsheets and Databases. All the files in the right pane are immediately deselected. While there are a number of backup sets available by default, you may need to create your own custom backup set to meet your own specific needs. Creating a custom backup set involves you selecting the specific file types and the folders to include or exclude from the set. You can create a custom backup set by right-clicking on the left pane and clicking Add Backup Set. The Mosey Pro Backup Set Editor window is displayed. Let's start by giving the backup set the name Training Documents. We first need to select the folders to search in. This is done by clicking on the plus symbol, expanding out the folders. We can then check the relevant folder that we wish to search in. If I select Training and Tutorials, a black tick is displayed on a white background, indicating that all folders under Training and Tutorials will be included. Scrolling back up, the C drive has a black check on a grey background. This indicates that the backup set will only look in some of the folders on this drive for files, that is, in the Training and Tutorials folder. My training documents consist of FrameMaker and Visio documents on my C drive. Therefore I will need to check the C drive. Check is now on a white background indicating that all folders on the C drive will be included when scanning for files. I have now selected the directories to select files from, so now I need to add the file types. Click on the Add Rule button. The rule field is open. Let's select to include file types FM for FrameMaker and VSD for Visio files. I really only need the files created since the start of 2010, so I need to add an additional rule to redefine the backup set. I do this by clicking on the plus symbol and selecting 
include created after the 1st of January 2010 The custom backup set is complete and when selected it will back up all FrameMaker and Visio files created on the C drive after the 1st of January 2010. Now click OK. The Mosey client scans for files matching this new backup set and displays them in the right pane. My backup set is now configured. Now let's take a look at some of the other options within the backup set editor. If I right click on my new backup set, Training Documents, and select Edit Backup Set, the Backup Set Editor window opens. I can add an additional rule that excludes files whose size is greater than 1000 KB. And if I want, I can remove a rule by clicking on the minus symbol. So now the backup set backs up all files on the C drive that are of file types FM or VSD and whose size is less than 1000 KB. There is just one more option to look at. After you've created a backup set, you can choose to exclude the set from your backups by selecting Files matching this backup set will be excluded from the final backup set. This option is only available if selected through the Advanced options. Click on the Options tab and then click Advanced and check Show Advanced Backup Set Features. Now go back to the Backup Sets tab. I don't want to backup any music files on my computer and to ensure this I will create a backup set that will exclude all music files from being backed up. I will need to create another backup set called My Music. I'll check My Computer and add a rule that includes all music type files. As I want these music files not to be backed up, I must check files matching this backup set will be excluded from the final backup set. Setting this option ensures that all music type files on my computer will not be selected for backup. Click OK. The list of music files on my PC is displayed and the new backup set is selected. So now all my music files on this PC will be locked. And if I click on the File System tab and try to select a music file, we can see that it is locked and unavailable for selection. Thank you for joining us for this tutorial, which explained what backup sets are and how to use them to select files for backup. We hope you have found it useful. For more information and other tutorials, please visit us at support.mosi.com.